2007 Toyota Tacoma with the 2TR FE. I'm going to attempt to uh, replace the head gasket without pulling the motor like uh, the factory manual says. Battery's been disconnected and uh, I've already uh, drained the coolant and removed the coolant hoses. I'm going to pull the radiator. I'm loosening the fan now and uh, we'll get the radiator assembly and fan out. All right, for the radiator bolts, you can go right through the grill. And one's there, and one's right here on the bottom. You can see it through the bottom grill. This one and that one's the mounting, same on both sides. Radiator, assembly, and fans out. And uh, now we're gonna pull some belts and wiring. All right, so I've unclipped the wiring harness. Um, there's some grounds here, some stuff here. I removed the air box. Unclipped, uh, there was one down there. And I unclipped everything here. Unbolted it from the fuse box. Slid it up and pushed it all over there. I also took off the air pump hose. Um, and now I'm going to uh, start pulling the valve cover. All right, instead of doing the valve cover first, I decided to do the intake manifold first. I pulled all the fuel lines. Um, there's a clip on here. So if you look at this, this clips off, unclips, and then there's two yellow things you gotta press to get it off. It doesn't use the normal uh, fuel release thing. You gotta press those two little tabs here on either side. Um, there are also, once you get the uh, fuel rail off, well, you gotta take off the, uh, the throttle body. So the throttle body here uh, keeps the fuel rail from coming out. So you gotta pull the throttle body and then pull the fuel rail. And then when you pull the manifold, there's two hidden bolts on the bottom. So don't forget those or you crack the manifold. All right, so the next step, I decided to pull the uh, manifold off. You gotta take the uh, two bolts for the exhaust that connect it to the manifold off. There's another bolt that connects it to a bracket that has to be removed. And then there's five bolts on the heat shield that gotta be removed. And then there's the uh, piece that goes here. I believe it's an EGR setup. And uh, there's four bolts to get that out. And now the manifold bolts can come off. Okay, so the manifold's been removed. And then I started removing the AC. There's four bolts that hold the AC on. There's a bracket right there that you gotta remove for the AC line. Um, four bolts holding the AC, three bolts that hold the AC bracket, that has to be removed. And then you also have two hidden bolts back here for the, in, um, the timing cover. So I was having a hard time, I finally found those and another water, uh, water port that has to be removed. Uh, timing case came off. I also removed the chain and the tensioners. I set everything to TDC with the timing marks lined up. There's a timing mark here. Lines up there. Another one here lines up there. Uh, they moved a little when I when I pulled the chain off, but they are set. Um, this is set to TDC. And I pulled all the uh, bolts off and it's always kind of a difficult to figure out where all those bolts go. I just got a box and I put all the bar bolts where they came off on the intake manifold. Uh, I'm sorry, not intake manifold, the uh, time to cover and through a water pump, which just for reference. All right, so I removed the, uh, the cams and then I uh, and I got all the cams out, and I got the head bolts out, and I got the head off. So you can pull the uh, head without removing the engine on a 2TR FE.
We got the 2T RFE going back together now. Uh, I had the head machined and uh, cleaned, checked for cracks. Um, I cleaned all the individual stuff. Uh, we reinstalled uh, the head, all factory Toyota parts. Um, I got the uh, head on, then we got the uh, valve train in. I got the front cover on down here and then um, had trouble finding some of the o-rings for the uh, the back part from the timing cover going into the block uh, Toyota didn't have a listing for them so uh, that was a little hard to find um, I'm gonna put a new front crank seal on it uh, and then we got all the timing uh, well we got all the timing set before we did that and uh, got that together all the valves uh, all that's in and the uh, cams have been torqued down.